two nice oranges of venison top side top rump and underneath is your silver side so we're going to trim this out now we're going to seam it you see this line there you just go straight into there all the way down to the back end you'll come to the hock Top side, silver side, top rump. And all you're left with is this nice little bone here to take out. Here we go again, top side, top rum, silver side on the bottom. You just see that little line there, that's your start you see. There's your bone again, there's your silver side, top rump. Do this one a little bit different, we'll take the bone out as it's still in. There you go, so you can see. Silver side, you've got your seam running down there. There you go, there it is. Take that bit off the top. There you go. That's your hockey bit. You don't want that in there. That'll be like chewing on rubber. That can go for stew. There you go. One nice silver side joint. That bit there is your top rump. That'll be some nice steaks. Here we are, your nice cannons. Two of them. When I refer to silver, that's your silver, that's all your sinew and tendons running down the back. We turn that over. Just get your knife. Give it a little bit of a neck. So you can get, your, get something to grab hold of. Start off nice and slow, so you can just see the meat coming away. A bit more. Once you get your knife all the way through and under, you should be able to run it all the way down. When your hands are gone a little bit wet, it gets a little bit difficult. There you go. That's all your silver off, that'll leave you a nice, a nice fillet look. On this one, same again, but the opposite way round. Bend on with your left or right handed. As you can 
can see. There's your silver. Do want that on there? All the way down. See, it's just coming off nicely. There you go. Job done. That's your fillets, your top dumps, your silver sides, and everything that you want for your Sunday roast and your barbecue.